BTF Sexy headphones once again reunited as myself. I am whole again, which is why I'm wearing a shirt that says can't be broken because I have headphones again. Sorry, my voice is a bit blah. Like literally throughout the whole time I've been gone, I've been sick and it's just been a pleasure. That plane is gonna sound like it's coming into my house. I just know it. Anyway, so I finally got my headphones in Saturday. I haven't done any recordings because I've been busy the whole entire time and I've been sick. So that's also kind of made me a little lazy, but it's so cool. My headphones came with some uh, with a Frelure Ash skin for League of Legends as well as I think it comes with like some bonus XP and I think that's it. But so this is what I got. The amazing box, my Gamecom 780s. And then look, you can even see the Frelior Ash in there as well, because I guess, I don't know, they're sponsored by League or they sponsor League or whatever the F. Some of the specs for those of you who don't know, and I am so excited, it's surround sound USB 7.1 technology. That rhymed. Anyway, so I don't even... <laughs> Sorry, I'm, I'm still dying, and now my camera's a bit... Yeah. Anyway, so as for getting the schedule a bit more on track, I'm going to try and upload a bit more to make up for lost time. I'm going to see if I can get consistently, like, put out a bit more videos, because I haven't done, I really haven't done anything. So I'm going to try and consistently get a bit more videos out for you guys, because it's been pretty dry for a week and um, I'm gonna hopefully have like a pretty full schedule and amnesia should be done soon and then after that I'm gonna be starting a co-op with a friend on Dead Space pretty soon as well as actually I don't know if you guys know who Necroscope is but um, he's a pretty awesome British YouTuber who's a million times bigger than me why well, he talks to me I'm not quite sure but we're going to do some haunting ground and I don't think haunting ground something a lot of people would be interested in actually watching um, because it's an old PlayStation 2 game I love it to death but I think we're just gonna do some recordings and I'm just gonna kind of piece together like the really fun parts of it and hopefully just make a fun silly video rather than do like a let's play on it because I originally want to do a let's play on haunting ground because it is one of my favorite games especially on the PlayStation 2 probably is my favorite game of the PlayStation 2 but I don't think it's a let's play people are going to watch because that game is old <laughs> so good uh, so we're gonna be doing some actually we're gonna be doing some recordings for that today I'm gonna finally record for stalker which I feel like I haven't done forever and maybe that other one I'm doing amnesia there we go <laughs> and uh, we'll see uh, how it goes hopefully we'll get things back on track I've actually been trying to like I mean as I've told you guys before you know I've been getting more serious about growing my channel making it bigger yada 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 so I've actually been trying to find collabs to do and I've been trying to message some people like hey you want to do a collaboration together and so far I haven't really gotten too many messages back so it's like that would be a no um <laughs> so I've been trying to find some collabs too because I think it'd be more fun to bring someone else in uh to have a bit more guest people so to speak I think I don't know why I did that Anyway, uh, to have more people in it, I think it'd be a little bit more exciting and a little bit more fun to have some different personalities in here and make it a bit more exciting for you guys as well as hopefully help them grow, help me grow, and then we all grow into the tree of life. Don't ask me what that means, I don't really know. <sighs> anyway, so I think that's all I gotta say about today and everything. So glad to be back. So happy to see you guys again. I've got these awesome lovely lovely new headphones to break in hopefully the sound will be so much better and you know we'll see how it goes i'm gonna have to start doing some tests and stalker make sure the levels are even and then we're gonna get rocking anyway so let's move on to story time and fact time so when i was in my first year of college over at northern illinois there's this one guy in rotc and i don't remember how this started but i decided to make a ransom note and again, I don't remember why I did it, but I literally cut to like cut out from pieces of newspaper because I wanted this thing to be legit. I cut out pieces of newspaper, like little letters or words if I can find them, and pasted them on a piece of paper and then had to go and paste it on his door. But here was the real kicker about that anyway. Uh, the dorm that he was in had an elevator and in order to get anywhere you have to actually have a key to that floor and you put the key into the uh, whatever and then you hit the button, that's how you go. And I didn't have a key to his dorm and I didn't quite know anyone who was on that floor 
and I couldn't tell him because I mean you just don't like say hey I'm gonna put a ransom note on your door can you let me in I mean that doesn't work so I had to ride the elevator for maybe like 15 minutes waiting for it to get to the exact right floor <laughs> before I could actually post this thing on this guy's door and I don't remember what it the, wh why that started but I do have a picture of it so here it is right here let me read it for you guys it says, Denna, Denna being his last name, because it's ROTC. It says, Denna, I have what you want. If you do not come to the Douglas Lounge at 9 p.m., I will destroy it. Signed, the Master of Deception. <laughs> and I didn't actually have anything, just an FYI. I didn't have anything. I just, I don't really know. I don't, I don't know what I was doing. Again, I don't remember the whys of that, but... That's something I did my first year of college. Because <laughs> instead of going out and partying like normal people, why not make ransom notes, ride the elevator for a long time, and put it on people's doors? <laughs> okay, and so, quick fact time. Used to be a huge fan of the anime Yu Yu Hakusho. Actually, if I watch it now, I'll still love it. And uh, I got the cards. I never got to really play the card game, but I got the cards. And one time, I think I skipped school. I think I pretended to be sick. I couldn't remember. But then I decided to be productive anyway. And I literally took the Yu Yu Hakusho cards and I taped them all around my window. No joke. I had literally like over a hundred or so more cards that I carefully taped all around the window. And it was just like this huge, like it was like, you know, painting on shutters or more like taping on shutters, but you know, with Yu Yu Hakusho cards, it was really silly, but I had that in my room for so many years, and I thought it looked so cool. I'm like, oh, I'm so good at decorating. I was, <laughs> was such a nerd. I mean, I still am, but <laughs> I'm slight, like I'm not an anime nerd really anymore. I'm just a gamer nerd. Anyway, I've been talking for a while. I'm kind of hungry. I woke up not too long ago, I didn't eat anything. I'm gonna go get some food and uh, then start on those recordings for you guys. So I'll see you guys in the stalker world. Bye! Feel my power!